we just got an iPhone X that needs a uh, speaker replacement. So we're going to be changing the top speaker. Uh, it's the earpiece uh, speaker that goes on the back of the screen here. Customer thinks that he spilled liquid on the top area of the phone, and as a result, the speaker is not working properly now. He hears a lot of uh, static noises, and the sound is not very clear. So he wants to change the earpiece speaker. We have an earpiece speaker here. Let me go under the microscope to show you what it will take to change that speaker. Unlike previous versions of the iPhone, to change the speaker, we have to either change the whole speaker along with the flex cable that has the light sensor on it, or we have to desolder the speaker from the flex cable and solder a new one back on. Now, I would like to keep the original flex cable that came with the phone, so we're going to be desoldering the two joints that we will see on the speaker. Let me show it to you quick. We're going to be desoldering those two joints here, and then we're going to solder back our new speaker. And that way, uh, we would keep the original flex cable that came with the phone. We do not know how well a third-party flex cable would do as far as the light sensor goes, so we want to keep the original one. And this is the new speaker here. We have to solder the flex cable to those two points here. So let's proceed. So let me see what tip I want to use. I think this should be good. Okay, so that's one area. Uh, the cable is adhered onto the speaker, so there's adhesive on the back. And that's it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to remove that old speaker and we're going to put a new one. Put the new one back in. So all we have to do is align it like so. and that's it the job is done uh, all we have to do is put the speaker back up like this uh, screw it in and put everything back on the phone i hope you enjoyed the video that was quick and easy go ahead and like this video if you liked it subscribe if you haven't already done so leave a comment if you have any questions and i will see you in the next video